Welcome to Chevin's Music. Today we're learning Circles by Post Malone. Let's get into it. So only a few chords you really need to know. C major 7. Uh, G over B. And F major 7 over C. And then an F minor with a bar. And the rest is pretty much the same. We're just going to change that F major 7 over C to a G6 over D, which basically is just sliding the chord up two frets. Super easy. So let's go over the parts of the song. The verse, uh, you're going to start with the C major 7 chord. And the strum pattern is going to be pretty simple. Uh, it changes throughout, but we're going to solidify it into one strum pattern for everybody. Uh, so we're going to start here, down stroke, down, down, and then up, down, up. Right? And then the next chord is going to be down, up, down, up, up, down, up. So it's down, up, down, up. Up, down. All right, so the whole thing together. All right, All right so the verse uh, kind of has that F minor in there. So we're going to start with the C major 7. Go to a G, B. Right, and then we're going to play an F major 7 over C, four finger chord. And then we're going to drop our second finger off, and we're going to bar the first fret, and we're going to keep these two fingers, and that's going to make our F minor. Right? And he only does that in the verse. Uh, so he does that in the first part of the phrase, and the second part, he just moves it up to the uh, G6 over D. Right? So it's to emulate a D chord, that last chord. So, so the first part of the phrase... F minor, and then again, and then we stay here, and then we're going to move it up two frets, alright, and that's the verse, so the chorus is, a, is actually a little bit easier, we're going to take out the F minor, right, and then we're going to play the C major 7, and then a G over B, great chord, and then we're going to go to our F major 7 over C, and we're going to stay there, and then we're going to start the phrase again. C major 7, G over B, F major 7 over C, and then move it up. Right? And that happens for four different phrases. So, Seasons change and different And that's pretty much the whole song. Now, stylistically, it changes a little bit throughout. You know, it may do a different strumming pattern. There may be places where just the bass is playing. Uh, sometimes the, the guitar is just playing one chord. You know, so listen for those in the song. You know, use a little active listening when you listen to this and try to play along. All right, so... Have a listen to this one. Let me know what you think. Uh, if you like what you've seen, don't forget to share, like, subscribe, all the great stuff to the channel. And we'll see you next time at Chevin's Music.